Today, I'd like to show you how to create a template from scratch with List Perfectly. If your screen looks different than mine, don't worry. I'm using the Pro Plus plan for this demonstration. With List Perfectly, you can create and store an unlimited number of templates on all plans. So how you create a template from scratch is go here, over here to Add Template. And this is going to bring up uh, your, empty, um, your empty listing template. And let's say that I came across um, several vintage t-shirts at an estate sale, and I want to make a template for those. So I'm going to put vintage uh, t-shirt. Um, they're all Brockham brand. They, they're all cotton. They're all uh, men's extra large. Um, I'll go down here and I can fill in the brand here. And I'm going to leave the color blank because they're all different, you know, they're not all the same color. So I can fill that in when I create my listing. Uh, they're all made of cotton. They're all, uh, we'll go ahead and put streetwear for the style. And they're all extra large men's. Um, and with your description, you can put, uh, you know, if you want to fill any of that in or, um, you know, anything like that. Or, or you can even leave a note here for yourself, um, you know, like don't forget to fill in uh, color. You know, you can do anything here that you want. And that way it, it kind of reminds you, hey, don't forget to fill that in. Or you can put a description, whatever you'd like to do. It will translate to your template. So then I also know that they're all pre-owned. They're all good condition. Um, and I also know that they... Uh, none of them have stains, so I'll go ahead and put no stains and no holes. I can put that in my condition notes. Uh, let's go down here to my keywords and pricing. I got these for $20 a piece. I got a good, really good deal. And I may go back and change the price on these. Um, I'm not sure, but I'm going to go ahead and put $500 for now. And I can always come back in when I do my listings and change it if I want to. And for the SKU, all of them are SH1 and all are quantity one. Now I can uh, click this button, suggest keywords, and this perfectly, um, what the information that I've already entered here, this perfectly will go through and uh, collect some of that. And it puts it right here uh, really conveniently for you to either copy or you can um, you know, type those in. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put, uh, let's say vintage t-shirt, they're all Brockham. Uh, they're all extra large men's size. They're all cotton. I think I'll leave my keywords at that because, um, you know, like I said, the colors and graphics are all different and I can add those real quick when I start to create my listings. So then we go down here to shipping. Um, I'm just going to put in 15 ounces for my uh, weight. You can use pounds, ounces, um, we can put in our zip code, um, then I want to put in my, uh, my package size. And with t-shirts, it's always going to be the same size for me because I use, uh, poly bags that are the same size. So that's, you know, and if you, you know, you end up, it ends up being smaller or larger. That's something you can quickly fit, you know, change when you go in and actually do your listing. So once you're done filling in your, um, information on your template, you want to be sure and go down here and click save and exit. And when you do that, it brings up your template list and you can go down and check. So here it is. Vintage t-shirt, Brockham cotton, min XL. So there's my new template that we just created from scratch in this perfectly.